this is my plant tour I've decided and I realized that I've wanted to make this video for a long time but I keep not making it because I keep thinking that like my house isn't clean enough or I should do it when there's like absolutely not even one thing out of place but like that's unrealistic and so we've got some like camping gear stuff out because we're going on a mini trip but I really want to show you my plants so are you ready to meet all of them I hope you are here we go where should we start I guess here first of all here's an overview of the room this is the room I'm most proud of I feel like it's really got the living plant aesthetic going and yeah I guess we'll start over here this is um Kai who is a big big monstera and um, they've got a couple yellow leaves right now and I have to chip, trim those off but um, I think they're doing okay. They might not have enough light where they are, but generally they're, they seem okay. So I love them very much. He's, or they are one of our like original babies who I just love. Um, this is Parker. Parker is a spider plant. Parker is probably the plant of all of our plants that's doing the worst, <laughs> but they, they're still alive and I don't know how. They used to like stand up really tall to like here and, um, but they outgrew their pot and then when I repotted them, they've been like this, but it's been like literally six months that they've been like this. So I don't understand why Parker's not doing well, but this is a spider plant. They're supposed to be very hardy and I guess they are because he hasn't died. So um, this is Finnelly. Finnelly is a mini baby snake plant, um, a bird's nest snake plant. Cause you can see it's kind of like um, grows in a little spiral. Um, Finnelly is named after finale because at one point I said finale would be my last plant and I think I've bought about eight plants since then <laughs> this is coffee this is a peperomia I don't really know much about them yet they're a baby they're doing okay had them for a couple months still alive this is lemon this is a baby pothos it's my teeniest baby pothos I have a couple pothoses and I just really like their color because they are like such a cute little lime -y color this is Merle, and honestly, Merle might be my favorite plant, but that's, oh my God, I don't want my other plants to know. This type of plant is called like an agalone, agalone, ah, oh fuck, I don't know. I'll, I don't know, I have two of this type of plant, agalonema or something, um, and I just really, really love him. I really just really like this like pattern on the leaves. I think it's so cool, and they're just so beautiful. Um, this is, oh my God, this is going to be 10 minutes long. <laughs> this is, ironically, this is Tully Planty. Um, hanging out with little crystal here. Uh, Tully Planty is also a snake plant, but a different type of snake plant. So, yep. Um, uh, Tully Planty is one of the shortest plants we have, but at the time we got him, he was the tallest plant we have. So Tully Planty. Uh, this is Garnet. She is a uh, Hawthornia and this new little thing came up out of nowhere and we thought it was like a separate plant but then I looked it up and this is like they're flowering so we don't know how long this is gonna go we we briefly thought this was a second plant that just somehow got in here and we named it plant drama because we were like oh my god so dramatic there's something happening in Garnet that's not Garnet um, but Garnet has grown a lot and seems to be doing okay and I really like her yeah that's my what I say about all my plants. I really like them. Um, this is a baby who I would like to rename. It's a pothos. Um, original name is Stemming, but I've realized that every time I call it Stemming, I think of a guy named Fleming and I don't really like it. So actually, I'm, I don't know how successful you can be at renaming a plant because I feel like once you've named it, it's hard to unname it, but we'll try. Um, this little baby has new growth, which I'm very excited about and pothos is trail so hopefully it'll like someday be like choo, 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 choo. that's me <laughs> okay here we go this is raptor uh this is a rattlesnake plant and raptor is really cool because raptor uh closes up every night and opens every morning so this is their open state i really like raptor very cool this is snail uh also a snake plant but some snake plants have this like yellow e thing that I really like. And I just got snail secondhand from someone who was getting rid of them 
for $30, which is very cool because tall snake plants are worth like $100. Um, and I really like snail, so yeah, that's snail. This is silver, teeny little guy. Don't really know how he's doing. Um, all of his leaves have grown to the front now. You can see in there, this is like a little packet that's supposed to get rid of fungus gnats, which are little flies we have right now. But um, I really like silver's color. And I hope that they trail and keep growing, but I'm not, I'm not sure how happy they are. We'll see. Um, this is Circe, also a snake plant. <laughs> Used to be named uh, Salazar. And then because of the transphobia of Harry Potter books, we renamed her Circe. Um, oh yeah, this is um, Clarabella. Oh no! <laughs> I just dropped the crystal that we got. Oh fuck. Okay, well, I, this is the crystal we got in Thailand. Do you remember? I don't think it broke, but Kylo fell. All this stuff fell. Ugh. Okay, I'll put that back. Sarah made that. Isn't that cute? I think it is. Okay, let me get back to the plant tour. So, oh, come on, Ray. Uh, <laughs> just go up here. I guess now they're making out of their Kylo's <laughs> uh, cloak. Okay. Uh, this is Clarabella. She is an air plant. And air plants are cool because they don't need to be in, um, like, dirt. But they do need to be soaked in water every once in a while. But I really like her, like, subtle pinky tones. Yeah, okay, she goes up here. That was very sad. Okay. This is Ghost, another air plant. Oh, it's kind of stuck in there. I'll leave him in there. He's uh, in Sarah's old little bulldog guy, and Ghost just kind of goes. Um, I love this one. This is Taco. It's, uh, this is a word I've read and not ever said out loud, a Dracania, Dracania, Dracana, I don't know. Taco, named after like Taco from the Adventure Zone, of course, not an actual Taco. And I just really like their leaves. I also love Taco, also one of my favorite plants. Love this guy. And oh, and way hidden under here is Pickle, who is Sarah's old cactus, who's still alive. So that's pretty good. Um, have I missed any? Man, there's so many. Okay, here we go. This is Charmaine. Uh, I don't remember what type of plant Charmaine is. Mom bought her for me for Christmas. Here, maybe I'll close the blinds. And then you can see would be better light adjustment. Oh my God, this is gonna take you so long to watch this video, I'm sorry. Okay, um, this is Charmaine. She's got kind of like purple undertones. I, yeah, I don't, oh, I think she's called a waffle plant. Yes, okay, waffle plant. Mom got her for me. This is Violet, who I love so much. Um, even though it looks like Violet's drooping weirdly, this is how they're supposed to be. They're just kind of like a weird, weird floppy plant. Um, I'll open this again. This is called a prayer plant and this is a brand new leaf that's coming out. It's going to unroll. So freaking cool. And I just really like these leaves. Yep. This is Nancy. Uh, Nancy's a new addition to my collection after Nancy drew, of course. And I don't remember what kind of plant this is. Frick. I'll have to look it up. Actually, I think it might say, oh, it's also a peperomia. Somehow Nancy and coffee are the same type of plant, but they're obviously different species of that plant, and I don't really understand, or different category, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> this is Greeny Planty, who is our original plant. We have no idea what kind of plant Greeny Planty is. They were 99 cents, and Sarah bought them when they were about this big, like it was basically that much of a plant, and um, got it for me when we first moved in together and it was really sweet and we can't believe the greeny planty is still alive and we feel like greeny planty being alive is probably entirely because no i mean the reason the green no <laughs> i can't talk okay um because we kept greeny planty alive we felt like we could get other plants so greeny planty is what started it all and with that, we are only about halfway through the tour, but we're at the 10 minute mark. So I'm gonna stop so I can upload this to something and then keep going for part two. So 
halfway through my living room. We've made it from here to here, part one.